Friday. Do a Friday day. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, and the visible liberty and justice for all. It's being in Friday, Super Size Edition. Wait, what? It is? Yeah. Well, did you hear about the super duper really awesome epic fifth grade field trip? No. Well, it is going to be a great. The Aquarium World of Coke and Civil Rights Muse Museum is we're going to be going there. That, that sounds super fun. Yeah. Also, did you know that this is Women's History Month? Let's hear it for the ladies. Uh, it is also March Madness. Five times five is 20 and 25. Yo, what are you doing? I'm practicing for the March Madness week for fifth grade. Oh. We're doing math. fact fluency with Moby Max. Oh, yeah. Math Madness in fifth grade and reading with fifth, fourth grade. Yep. That's right, guys. See ya. We have very talented and active staff at ALB. We have several teachers who are also coaches in spare time. We know Coach Shelton, but Ms. Steeman coaches basketball, Ms. Lumenson coaches swimming, and Ms. Jean Charles coaches track and field. Oh look, this is Ms. Jean, Jean Charles' office right here. Let's see if she's here. When did you start running? Ooh, I started running track my freshman year of high school. Cool. Yeah. What is your favorite event in track? Uh, definitely has to be hurdles. I'm a little partial to that because <laughs> that was my event and now I coach it. Um, why do you think track, track is an important activity? I think that it's a really great way for people to kind of get some stress relief. And I like it because... Um, although it's a very individual sport because everyone has their own events and stuff like that, it's still a, a big team sport. So mm -hmm. like you have to do really well in your individual event in order to make sure that you can get points for your team so that the whole team can win. And yeah, that's really the best part. If we are interested in track, how should we prepare? Ooh, being interested in track. Um, just get out there and run. Like, Play tag with your friends, mm -hmm. try have mini races, like see if you can get to the finish line the fastest. And then when you get to middle school, join middle school track and you get to hang out with me. <laughs> Why did you start track? That's actually a funny story. I did not want to do track <laughs> when I first started. I thought track was like the craziest thing in the world. Why would I want to run in a circle all day long? That sounds crazy. Um, but I had a, a boyfriend in high school and he wanted to run track. So I was like, all right, well, I guess I'll do track too. And turns out that I stayed on the track team and he decided not to do track afterwards. <laughs> like when, who was like, who was your favorite like person in track? Like, oh, okay. So I have two people. So there's Lolo Jones. She is um, an Olympic um, hurdler. And my high school coach used to nickname me um, Lolo Jones. And then there's Sonia uh, Richardson Ross, who is also an absolutely amazing hurdler. And she, I actually got to meet her um, over the summer. She came and we had an Olympic, like a pre-Olympic meet and a lot of like pro athletes came and she was the host and I got to meet her. I got to take pictures with her and I actually just saw her last night at our meet too. Um... I don't know any more questions. That's okay. <laughs> that was cool, though. Thank so. you. Thank you. Thanks for coming to interview me. Take your bitch.
Watch me switch it and never let it. Step, I will never land. I got a ready.